workout and I think it's 940 something I don't know to be honest but I'm gonna target my arms again I, I didn't do the abs yesterday but I can do some more 10 you know that's usually like I have the mindset where I have to do everything right now and it's kind of bad like like I don't know why I have the mindset like I should really be taking my time with everything you know really be patient but I'm gonna be working out with this one look check me out it's actually this one I put in the anxiety one it helps with calm down enhance mental health enhance mental health prevent panic attack anxiety stress and depression 528 hertz music so yeah i would definitely recommend you checking that one out it's in my uh, anxiety room the the um ya me esto corte de pelo it's because i put shampoo because you know my hair i think because usually i go like two three days without putting shampoo because i just started water and then put shampoo and then slowly it starts getting back to we know wavy or curly but yeah i'm just gonna work out I just asked God, cause I was I was already counting, and then I lost count. He told me I'm gonna tell him how much push-ups I did, cause I know I did more than 300 right now. But I fast forwarded because obviously, are you really gonna watch me working out for that long? <laughs> like I have to fast forward it. Like, but um, yeah, like the reason why I got inspired by doing push-ups is because. There's one time I was in a Coach Davis live stream back in October of 2020, and he was like, "Come on, come on, do the pushes with me, G, something like that." And then, and then I, and then I, I did them, and I kept doing them and doing them and doing them. And usually I limit myself to like 115 or something like that, 17. But I noticed that I got a huge, huge pump, and I was like, "Wow!" Like, and then from there I started doing them. And at that time, I was falling on the top. But now, I don't know what God is doing, but now I'm able to do more push-ups than I was before. Uh, I think he told me I did 330 or something, but I'm not sure. Like, I need to, like, like be talked to him in a more softer tone because, you know, like, I do them until I physically can't. And still Coach Davis, he said, he, he was saying, <coughs> if you don't force growth, you don't want to bad enough. Because you're, show, you're showing the universe, which is you. Like, hey, look, like, you're just trying to move like, hey, look at how much work I'm doing. How much from there, you know? Step on the bus, must uh, punch out my, my mouth. Um, yeah, like, I, I do them, like, do them until you physically can't do it. My progress look. This is I'm not flexing like this is not a flex. I'm just keeping my arms straight. I just need a six pack, that's it. Like that's all I need. But yeah, like I'm not gonna stop grinding, like I'm gonna keep going until I physically can, you know. Just to show the just so just to impress God, you know. Are we gonna talk about our semen or are we gonna talk about transmuting the semen? I'm gonna talk about transmuting and I don't give a fuck about talking about that. And that's cause, and that's cause I had a wet dream yesterday and I'm on day 14. I'm about to reach day 15, but look, now, now I'm flexing for real this time, I'm flexing, like for real. You know what I'm saying? Like, oof, 
be a model or a woman's secret. I was thinking, I was like, damn, like if I get super big, I can be like the security guard for like the strip clubs, you know? Like, like those, uh, those security guards that are like, clean shame. Those security guards that are like, like in GTA 5 where they're just like, they're all huge and shit. But yeah, like, um, instead of you, instead of you playing GTA 5, how about you, how about you, you how about you stop playing GTA 5? And how about you play the actual real life GTA 5? And how about you, you, you make this video game character like super buff, you know? Because, hey, like, we have one life and then eventually it's game over, you die, so you might as well make the best out of it, you know? I don't know, like, I don't know if God told me I did 330. I feel like I did more, but we're gonna keep working out. Como dice Drake, all <clears> the <throat> puras flemas. All I gotta, I was trying to sing, but it doesn't come out. So I'm gonna just say, all I gotta do is put my mind through that shit. Cancel all my texts. I don't know what he said, but that's all you gotta do. Just put that mind through that shit. That's it. I have to dab up the angels first. I have to dab them up. And I got I got Mr. 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 Rafael and Mr. Michael. And some other couple of angels that I, I don't know their names, but I have to dab them up. I don't know where you're at, but thanks for protecting me cuz. Appreciate that. I gotta give I gotta give glory to the most eh? Cause if it wasn't for him, I would have never been here in the simulation. But yo, like, I still have more energy, so I'm still gonna keep doing more push-ups. Shout out to my, my cousins that are, you know, currently going to this war or whatever. Este, shout out to este, um, Sweet P, Ankil, and Tommy. Shout out to you guys. I will send, I will, I'm gonna pray for you guys, like, non-stop. Like, I'm, I'm not gonna stop praying, I'm gonna send you guys angels and and protection and because you are my family and yeah these push-ups these push-ups for you too so yeah you're you're protected with the most side I asked God how many push-ups I did, and all I got was 500, so, yes, um, <clears throat> like, I'm not, like, it's kind of hard to keep track, you know, but, look, look at my bag, see, like, you really have to fight your, your, yourself, you have to push yourself, you have to push yourself. You know, now it's because sometimes it happens where I start like I start talking like very como rude, and I'm not, I'm not sure that makes God go away. But I have to constantly be surrendering right now. I have the Holy Spirit, so I have to like como in a way like catch myself and not talk rude and you know talk in a soft tone voice because. That's what right. I'm not that I'm not forcing myself to talk like the Holy Spirit is making me talk like that. But yeah, like um I'm gonna I don't know if I should keep doing it. I think I should keep doing it. Cause I already did them at Seattle, so I'm probably gonna keep doing it. But I need to stretch first, you know. I worked out so much and I was about to make a protein and then Cause I always make protein with banana shake, but looks like I can't make a protein anymore. Like I don't even like this dried bananas. Like I'm not even gonna bother to even taste it. Like, and these are brand new, but 
the brand new ones have to wait como like three four five days for that way it can taste normal because they taste super como like it you know how green bananas taste but like damn like that sucks like i worked out and i was about to make a protein and now i can't make it because there's no banana Sometimes I wonder, like, why my life went the way it went. Sometimes, you know, it gets depressing, you know. Because I have suffered a lot. And I don't really show my pain on camera because um, I just prefer, you know, not to show it. But, yeah, like, you know. It's just, I'm just gonna... I'm just gonna keep praying and keep working my promise until I get restored because hey, what I work is dead. So, yeah. So, cause whenever I post the um, my YouTuber me talking, there's always an employee that checks my my. There's always an employee that that watches my video, and then cause I know this because I, I I was I was picking up and I, I was like, why is the video taking so long to upload? It's already at one hundred percent, and I and and I and I was picking up on like the energy that someone some some employee was watching me, but. Thank you, thank you for 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 copywriting all my stuff. Thank you for age restricting all my stuff. Thank you for removing all my videos. Thank you. And then I was seeing it from God's point of view uh, today, and I was like, wow, I do not deserve to get copyright. I really don't. All that hard work, me me putting all that hard work just for you to 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 copyright me. Like, do you do you not know that I'm promoting work workouts? And and you 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 know who you are, employer. Like stop stop doing that. Do you not know that I'm a king? It's like come on, like let's do this whole. And I'm like, I literally told my, I told my family, I was like, why don't you just throw away everything? Like, what is the whole point? That, that really messed up my whole workout. Like, I could have been doing so much ab workouts, but no, my family, they want to keep stuff in the garage. Like, throw it away. Like, I threw away all my clothes. Like, it's called growing up and be like, you know what? Am I ever going to use this? No. Throw it away. Let's keep on going. God just told me to get some rest. But it was like. I mean, it's already late, it's already like 12, 29. So after this one, yeah, I'm out of there. <clears throat> okay. You know, just to get lower abs, you know. I've always heard God say you're disobeying. Okay, go. I'm gonna go to sleep.
Like, now time to a big gun. Like, porque a mí es que dormir, güey.